Hello and welcome back here again to Pokemon Violet. Oh, look at that. Pokemon Violet. Um, what we just saw was the normal version of the Titan we fought in the last part. If you haven't seen that, you should definitely check that out on my channel. And yeah. If you have already checked that out and... I don't know, maybe you are subscribed already, and if you're not, what the hell are you doing? You should press that subscribe button. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you are already subscribed and you have seen the last part, then I greatly, greatly, of course, welcome you back. And yeah, you know what? interesting let's say uh, of a little titan change that was it was not a real like um challenging titan pokemon itself but yeah uh it was well we needed to use Moraiden to catch it let's just say it like that and that's the normal version of it and it is a steel type Oh, it has an interesting cry though, of worm. Incinerate's not gonna one hit it, will it? We are one level higher, and it's super effective. I don't think it will one hit it. If so, that would be not nice, because I would like to catch it. Ooh, oh, that's great, actually. Uh, let's catch it. Great boss should be enough. It's not enough. <laughs> okay, Iron Head. Oh, damn. You know what? Let's use an Ultra Ball. Because we have a few of them. What? Oh, no. That's Minecart gone, is it? Okay, Minecart avoided the attack. <laughs> now it would be good to have Bronzor. What can I do? I don't wanna kill it, but... It's faster than me, right? Yeah. I could hope that I... Mm, elect by the, mm, hmm. Do we have different ball? Nest ball, dusk ball, timer ball... Quick, action timer ball is... More turns that are taken in the battle. We only have one though. Lower the level of the wild Pokemon. Ah, uh, not good. At night, actually, it is night. Come on, Dusk Ball. Oh, why is it so hard to catch a level twenty-seven? Why is it so hard to catch a level 27? I'll switch out Pokemon. Why is it so hard to catch a level 27? I either Luxio kills it now or it barely survives and gets paralyzed. I obviously hope that the second thing will happen. Obviously, it knows it's a perfective attack and my speed falls. Yeah, 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 okay. I should have used Thundershock. Oh, because Thundershock makes less damage. Yeah, it's okay. We got it. You are fast. Ooh, just managed that. Come on, that should be enough. Even for the Dusk Ball. It's night, it's got the lowest HP I can handle it to do. Stay in. You are fucking kidding me! 
How is Luxio still alive? I'm going to use the last dust ball. I have. No, and it killed itself. Oh, come on! Yes, yes, ghastly. Yes. Ah! Uh, it killed itself. <laughs> Ah, oh, yeah, right, I forgot to guys, uh, what, I forgot to tell you guys, uh, to, what Meridon can do now after eating the salty Herba Mystica, um, as you know, uh, to get up slopes we always tried to reverse jump, and sometimes it just didn't work, like this time, but now we can do this, jump way higher <laughs> than <laughs> before, almost twice as high, I think. And further, obviously, with the two. Of course, we cheated our way through with the reverse jump sometimes. Interesting. I just want to get these items. Um, can we actually jump? Or Ooh, the dive ball. That looks good. Holy, <laughs> we can. Yes, dive ball looks cool. Water Pokemon, obviously. But I think we're. Mm, way more than good enough for float so I should find a actually no no but mm, may maybe we find a water Pokemon I like more than float so uh, I'm going to use that of all because I have like one or two my god, stop lagging, holy shit, one or two, whoops, uh, Pokemon in mind. Tick tock, tick tock, alright. I'm going to <laughs> heal up. Yeah, heal up my Pokemon a little bit. <laughs> Especially Luxio. There you go, should be enough to face this trainer. Oh, it's, um, yeah. Come on, let's have a battle of fun. Lander, the backpacker. Impidim. I have never, ever seen or heard of that Pokemon before. And I have no clue what typing that thing could be. This pink violet thingy. What the hell? Usually speaks for psychic. And or ghost. Not so much for But why does it. Okay, why does it metronome? Oh, oh. The animation for Agent Paul is interesting. My bo actually both of my Garatinas in yeah I have two Garatinas in um Pokemon Platinum because I have two Pokemon Platinums. Um granted one's from my sister but uh I now have it. So I have two Garatinas and uh I'm going to catch a third one. I'm <laughs> actually shining uh, shiny hunting it because I, I I'd love to have a blue one. Uh but that's not the topic right now. I have two Garatinas and both no ancient power. I have to say, even though this animation is quite cool, uh, ancient power from Platinum, because you have more rocks that get thrown at the enemy, right? This is just four rocks. I mean, they have this cool little aura around them, yes, but you throw four rocks at the enemy and that's it. And in Platinum it's like ten or something or even more. Uh, which is w way cooler if you ask me, because it's just a big wave of rocks that they r throw at you. It's like a, an earthquake has um, caused some uh, rock slipping or something, you know what I mean? 
And this is just, yeah, I throw a rock at you. So it could be rock throw. <laughs> rugged? I would say rigged, but okay. Seems rough and rugged places like this attract a lot of hardy Pokemon, huh? Finia. Is that a water type? The fairy water, something like that? Um, if so, it's gonna have a double effectiveness against me, because water is effective against rock and... Oh, is it effective against rock, actually? I think so. But it's definitely effective against fire. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh okay. god. <laughs> yes, it is of course effective by, uh, against rock. Um... Amori? <laughs> Amori? <laughs> Come on, we're so close to the Poker Center. We don't need someone dying now. I I want the XP, I need the XP. Water Pulse. I'm going to just magic leave you. Boom. This Finian gone. Cool fish, I will keep my current Pokemon. And I'm going to show this student something that he doesn't know. Very fair, but if you're in front of a Poker Center, we can just do it and one shot this Pokemon. It's not a one shot, I should have used Seed Bomb, but this animation is cooler. I don't care, I'm gonna use it again. I have to say, at least with all these effects and stuff, at least the battles uh, are smooth. At, I would say, almost 60 FPS. Level 30 for Luxio. We're getting closer to Luxray! Oh, the trainers are hardies too. <gasps> Speaking of closer to Luxray... Perfect timing! I love it! Luxray! Luxray's ability to see through objects comes in handy when it's scouting for danger. It does look quite a bit different though, I think. It's got more... Does it ha... It's got more black, I think. Than in Platinum. Lux... Ray... If I could spell... Actually, it doesn't. But why does it look so much more blue in Platinum? Oh, well, wrong Pokemon. Ah... Uh, no. Let's try come back here. It looks so much more black than... Oh, I, I don't care. We've got Luxray now. I'm happy. <laughs> this is a good part. Alright, come on Luxray. Let's get you and the rest of the team healed back up again. Firestorm. Ah, this guy again that asked us if we had some nice battles. <laughs> Pokemon League rep. Yeah, look at that Luxray. <sighs> I'm glad it evolved at level 30 already, because I thought it would evolve at like level 36 or something. Um, but yeah, I'm glad. I'm very glad. I love Luxray. Right. My lovely place, Punching Glove. But this protective glove boosts the power of the holder's punching moves and prevents direct contact with targets. So if you have like any, f I guess, fighting moves where the Pokemon punches. Um, oh, this looks lovely. Right here. If you have any fighting moves where the Pokemon punches, um, 
Oh, cool. Training code. Um, I guess something like Flame Buddy uh, will not have an effect on that. That is a lovely small town. Yeah. We've got Luxray. So cool. Did I already tell you guys I love Luxray? Yeah. <laughs> if I could, if I could have. If I could have any Pokemon that's not a legendary as a starter Pokemon, it would probably be Luxray. Alright, that's already it. That's everything there is to this little town. Can I... Obviously I have to try if I can go into these doors. But I don't think so. Not in this. Oh. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> I wonder what's, what's the thing behind this. Oh look. This is one of those flying taxis we fly with, instead of having a flying animation. Flying taxi here, take a ride through the sky, powered by Squawker Billy. Need a lift? Just open your map app, give us a call, we pick you up from practically anywhere. What is Pokemon even strong enough? <laughs> I mean, never judge a book by its cover. So, so everything special, really, that is to this town is it looks quite neat, and it's in the middle of literally a formation of rocks. <laughs> My buddies and I battle a Pokemon at court on our way home from work. Yeah, makes sense. And there's like two or three shops here, and that's it. Alright. And a Luxray. <laughs> Look at it. I love it. Alright, let's not waste any more time here. Let's see where. We are heading next. Let me just very quickly get out my handy dandy map again. Oops. And the next thing we should do. We already did. And that is the water type gym. Yeah, which we were pre challenged to level up to that. The next thing after that is the poison type gym, which we are right in front of, as you can see right here. And we should have an average of level 33 when we get here. I can. I need to go backtrack anyway. I need to go through here, or either there, to get up here. Uh, it's it's not a gym, it's a, the Team Star Base, idiot. Um, and I guess I can't even go this way. Let us try. But usually with Team Star Bases, you can't really get around them. Let's see. That a zipper passage. Classic. Glaseido Mountain. What the hell is that? <laughs> Not a horse, this Pokemon. Oh, need uh, music. OXP Candy M. Free? You know what it means. I mean. I really only have a room in the team because I, wa I want to see if it actually evolves into what I think it will evolve. And I'm gonna use one of them. Yeah, just one. Level 20 was enough. Screech. What does it know again? I completely forgot. 
Also Taka's defense is that's good. Uh I don't think Jaro is a Because that thing tends to go fast. I mean, it's literally a car part, but yeah. I'm also going to give one to Luxray. Just to get the levels up. Poison. Poison, poison, poison. What's good against poison is the question. Um, it's like... Is grass good against poison? Cause you know, like some flowers or some uh, other plants are good at healing you up again. In real life at least. Weakness is ground and psychic. Ground and psychic. <laughs> Which would mean Bronzo Wooper could also be a candidate because it's partly poison, wouldn't really take damage, but it's only level 18. Ground and Psychic, and of course, Silicobra would be. Um, hmm, I don't think Silicobra can hit the car with its moves. Uh, Ground and Psychic. Um. Hmm. What's poison good against? Fairy and. Oh, grass. Wait, how much? 92. Ground and Psychic. Yeah, I'm going, I'm going to move Bronzo in for the room. Oh, there was a Pokemon right here. Oh, it's... <gasps> that is, yeah, Grievous. If we get the evolution of that, that knows an attack. That knows an attack. And it's level 43, we should definitely catch that. That knows an attack that gets um, stronger the more deaths you get in your team. Oh yeah. Run. Okay, right. Yono said Pokemon up to level 40 should be easier to catch. But we have seen that. Come on, stay in. It's a hyper ball. There we go. It didn't even re refuse, yeah, to get caught. Ah, uh, no, I won't. This friendly Pokemon doesn't like being alone. Pay it even the slightest bit of attention, and it will follow you forever. I'm going to check the summary. What does it know? Play rough, rest, crunch, and dig. <gasps> Ground and psychic. My rest is. Yeah, of course, rest is just so you can heal up again, but it's a ground type move. And it's level 4. I am going to switch this out. As this will be our highest level Pokemon. I'm going to switch this out for minecart, actually. There we go! The question is, um, do I need to catch its evolution in order to get that attack, or will it learn that attack once it evolves? Because it learning that attack once it evolves would be good enough for us. Okay, we can just go straight. The team star base is at the other end here. Could just go straight through this. Do I have here a poker center? Hmm. 
We're gonna get a uh, better this trainer and then go back. Uh, your Pokemon seem really strong. I wanna better them. Alright, Teo. Tauros. There we go. Ooh, it's level 36. I think we are only supposed to go this route after we beat uh, the thingy, but I think we can still beat his Tauros. I don't know if I will survive an attack though. We have five levels lower. This one's almost dead. You know what I'm gonna do. Flotsa will hopefully survive one attack. <laughs> Zen headbutt. I just hope floats. Uh, okay. Let's just hope floats is fast enough. Yes. Yeah, that's enough. I stead things for water type now. It also knows the normal headbutt. I stead things a water type now. We're going to absolutely destroy it. <laughs> Alright, come on Amari. A seed bomb should be enough. Even though it Oh it's only three levels higher than or two levels higher than us actually. Ooh, raging bubble. Oh my god, why was that super effective now? Fire attack attack? Oh my god. Whoo, there we go. That's a strong Pokemon you got there. The Tauros. But we still just managed to defeat him. And you got two level ups. Nice. Hey boy, don't get me wrong, you were strong. <laughs> One of the strongest single uh, Pokemon trainers I've beaten in this game. Oh, I've battled in this game, actually. Wait, there. So if we go through this. Oh! We get here. Wait, there. But if we go up here. We get to. Here and that's it. But as I said, we want to go back here and beat, um, beat the Team Starbase first. Which I guess we are going to do, obviously, in the next part. And yeah, I hope you guys liked the part. If so, press that thumbs up. Um,. I mean, Luxray alone is worth the thumbs up, isn't it? <laughs> I would say so. So, yeah. Uh, show this project some love. Uh, I enjoy doing it, and I hope you enjoy watching it. And, yeah, I am hope you guys have a great day. And stay safe out there. And I'm going to see you guys. Luxray, I'm going to see you guys in the next part. Bye-bye.